alaikum brothers and sisters. It's nice, chilly, cold day. Alhamdulillah, we're back again with a fresh start of the new year, bringing you new restaurants, halal restaurants, authentic food, inshallah. And looking forward to see you guys to the new place we're here at today. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah, everybody. As you guys can see, we're here at Northern Smokes. Um, it's a chilly day today, and uh, we needed to, you know, uh, make it better by coming to this restaurant. Why make it better by coming here, brother? Because this restaurant only serves beef, you know, and, um, and chicken, and they, chicken. But they're famous for their <laughs> briskets and uh, their ribs, and uh, they smoke it. They smoke their meat in this uh, yeah. this smoker. Um, this is Northern Smokes is like an iconic. Um, brisket restaurant in Toronto. Brother Imran, where are you putting all that meat away, man? No, we're going to bring it out here Bring it out. Bring it out here for Allah. you. Show you, what you guys what we deal with. Um, wow. Because of our quality, wow. 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 the grade, and um, what we work with. So okay, guys, this is Brother Imran. He's the owner for Northern Smokes. He's going to show us what Northern Smokes is all about today. Imran, by Superstar Rehan behind this is This is Rehan, <laughs> one of the superstars. So Imran, by tell us about yourself first and what made you come up with this concept, first of all, of Northern Smokes in Toronto. Backyard idea. Oh wow. Backyard, you started from back, your backyard? Started from our backyard. We started smoking meat in our backyard. Alhamdulillah, we had a you know, good group of friends that started uh, purchasing off us, making a WhatsApp group and just getting our community. Uh, how, how long ago? About four years ago. Four years? Four years ago, we were in our backyard smoking uh, out of the ground and out of Weber smokers, and yeah, I don't think many people in our community uh, have backers. Uh, yeah, right exactly. Now. How do you feel yourself being in this uh, restaurant position, mashallah, serving this? Um, I, I'm pretty sure you feel proud, mashallah, because people wanted to travel so far for these things, and you brought it for us in Toronto. So for me, it's, it's honestly like I, the reality is it's not possible without these guys. Yeah, you understand what I mean? It really is. It at the end of the day, if you, if you don't have uh, a team and a crew willing to do their job. These guys go to school. Mashallah. And they're studying to become positive members of our community, right? So we're just like a stepping stone for them. Teamwork. Teamwork. Exactly. And so what do you have for us? Tell well, us so the source. So this is, so our source is uh, primarily St. Helens. So just to give you guys an idea, uh, we like St. Helens meat for a couple of reasons. Obviously, it's because it's halal. Yes. But the grade of their meat is the best. Okay. Okay. Um, we do have some issues with... Um, you know the, the actual cutting from the facility on the back of the brisket but we are working with them hand in hand to get things corrected uh what do i mean by the grain you're gonna have a hard time finding canada prime brisket anywhere um usually our tri-tip will be prime as well but if they don't have prime we'll get certified angus and the quality of the brisket will speak for itself when you eat it yes the marbling on the brisket on the inside there if you look at it okay tell us this i have no knowledge you tell me People talk about this marbling on the meat. So the marbling is just basically the fat to meat content. I'm not a big, like Wagyu beef is supposed yes. to be the best. Yeah. I'm not a big fan of it because I find it has too much fat in it. That's mm -hmm. just me and a personal preference, right? Um, prime, I find it's the best that I enjoy. Okay. So when we cut a prime brisket, we can tell right away it's a prime brisket because of the water, the juices, yes, and the fat yes, content yes. that's coming down off of it, right? So now this brisket that you guys see here that might weigh about 15 pounds, by the time that we're done trimming it, it's going to weigh... 10 pounds by the time we're done cooking it's gonna weigh eight pounds okay I got just you. to kind of give you an idea of the cost so if you're really paying five dollars a pound for this uh, if you already know you're losing 20 percent so um yeah we'll trim this brisket um salt pepper and in the smoker it'll go that's all you use salt pepper salt pepper is all we use on our brisket um we use uh vegetable oil or mustard as a binary to put the salt pepper on there that's all we use. We, want, we want our smoke flavor. And source for the chicken? Uh, chicken we have uh, very various kinds. This so I have my brother-in-law's peri-peri marination that we okay. bring in. Uh, we have a jerk marination. We let it marinate for two, three days, and then that goes in a smoker. Uh, uh, comes out of the smoker, we're going to give it a grill, and then give it to you. Got it, man. That's it. Thank you so much. No problem. Guys, this is for my good friend, Zia Tabarak Chale. <laughs> so guys, uh, this is where the magic happens. This is a smoker. Wow. Um, at the bottom, you guys can see uh, it's all chicken, and uh, on the top, this is uh, these are the short ribs. And uh, how long do you guys have to smoke these for? Like, sort of take seven hours. 
Okay. Yeah, it takes a long time and uh, a lot of effort uh, to get this ready. And this is where the magic happens for the briskets. Uh, this is like a meat heaven. And uh, as you guys can see, it's all filled up with beef. Um, so these are the beef short ribs yeah. being prepared. One pound is usually one bone. It has lot, uh, a lot of meat on top as compared to the back. So this is like four pounds? This is four pounds. Okay. Sometimes we have bigger racks. Those are about five to six pounds as well. This is roughly four pounds. This is what we're talking about now. This is, this is meat heaven. Nice uh, coleslaw salad. Crispy, crunchy. They have these pickles too on the side. So man, you gotta try the English style beans. <laughs> I'm gonna try all of this. Try all right now. So what do you call these? <laughs> I call it English style beans. <laughs> Usually in the UK, that's what they serve for breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> Means as per Milano. <laughs> I named it. Oh, they actually taste nice. Gold English style beans, you know. <laughs> so people, you guys should tell us in the comments. Are these actually English style beans? I named it. Anything we eat, we have to get some desi thud. Try this aloo ka burka. I'm going to macaroni try it. We're going to try these mac and cheese. The sides are very nice. They have a lot more to it. They have different types of uh, fries also on, on, on their menu. But this is like their top notch items which we have in front of us today. Everything is good, mashallah. Very good. Amazing. Excellent. Are you in if you're living in Toronto or anywhere in Canada, whenever you come to Toronto, you got up. This is like the iconic Northern Smokes. Okay, so guys, uh, I'm gonna be trying this drink. It's called the Black Cherry. It's made by Sugar King. Um, I haven't seen it before. I'm gonna give it a try. It's actually nice. You wanna take uh, a second sip? It deserves a second sip, man. We forgot that. Wow, actually tastes really good. Wow. And this one is the cane cola. It's like a candy, um, but it's nice. Yeah. I like it. I like it. Malana, this is why I was telling you on this cold, chilly morning. You gotta have northern smokes. You gotta northern eat the smokes, beef. I'm telling I'm not you, wearing a jacket now. It's a good not place. Feeling too cold. It's, it's a best place to come. Here's the deal. You come here using our promo code in the description below. They have the nicest, the bestest, uh, the brisket burgers they have. It's worth nine dollars per burger, but using our promo code, you get three burgers for twenty dollars only. It's a one full meal, and apart from that, on, they have a very good top of the line menu. I'm telling you, you're gonna enjoy. We have another surprise for you. Well, it's ten dollars, man. We 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 are getting you ten dollars off. We're getting you ten dollars off, exactly. And not even that, we're giving a Raptors giveaway. As you guys can see, we love the Toronto Raptors. Uh, that's our team. Um, for that, you guys will have to like and subscribe to this channel and comment your names in the section below. And we're gonna be um, uh, 
posting more details on Halal Boys, our Instagram page. Follow uh, Halal Boys on TikTok and regarding, Instagram. Regarding this giveaway. So yeah. I think the, the game is on February 12th. Um, so we're going to be doing a giveaway for that. There's two tickets for the Raptors game. Enjoy the deal. Enjoy the promo. And enjoy the meal. See you in our next vlog. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.